Uh, we're looking at the latest and greatest V8 from General Motors. This is the LT7, found in the new C8 ZR1 Corvette. It's exclusive to that car as far as I know. It's a 32 valve double overhead cam, V8, flat plane crank, it's 5.5 liters. And unlike the Z06, this one also has twin turbos on it. 75 millimeter turbos, good for 20 PSI. They go through these uh, water to air intercoolers right here then right into this intake manifold. So this car is gonna have very minimal turbo lag. Look at how short that, uh, that, that path is right there. One of the things that surprised me when I saw this, I thought this was a cast aluminum intake manifold. The Z06 has a plastic, but then I went up to it and I touched it. And well, that's still plastic. It's just made to look like cast aluminum or something like that. So they fooled us, but over a thousand horsepower. I forget what the torque is on this. uses a total of 16 fuel injectors on it and it's a hybrid system it has eight fuel injectors here on the port and another eight fuel injectors down here go right into the cylinder direct injected ones and what's interesting about these is they're on the hot side of the engine where the exhaust is that hot turbo there so special provisions have to be made extra water has to circulate through around the block here to keep it cool and my guess is that this is for emissions. I think the engine starts on these uh, port fuel injectors here, and then once it gets warmed up to proper temperature, then it could switch to the uh, direct injection system like that. The Mustangs have had this since I want to say 2018 in the Coyote engines, and that system works really well when you're adding more power to the system because you can take advantage of both, both sets of fuel injectors, and you have lots of fuel for extra boost in the 85 and things like that. Another thing I didn't mention is that this has mirror symmetrical turbos on it, so there's a designated left and a right one. It also has the uh, dry sump oil system. It's nothing new that's been found on Corvettes since the uh, C6 Z06. And that's about it. Look forward to seeing this on the streets.